Have you got selected in TCS but you are still worried about the TCS onboarding updates? You are still sitting in a home and wondering when I am going to get the joining letter. So don't worry, this is the perfect video for you. So just in case, if you are new to our channel, I highly recommend you to subscribe to the Runtime Error. So without wasting in time, let's get started. So I am Pramod Bosley, I am working as a system engineer in TCS for nearly one and a half years and I am working at TCS Digital Profile. So I highly recommend you to watch this video till end because being a part of the TCS, I know every in and out of joining process. So we are going to discuss joining things for nearly in three steps. So I am going to tell you three steps to just to know when you will going to receive your onboarding or the joining letters. So without wasting in time, let's get started. First thing that comes on mind is what is the current situation regarding the TCS onboarding. So everyone knows that the IT sector in whole world is having the recession, right? And this is the reason why most of the companies are delaying or keeping on their hold to their employees. The only reason behind this is because there is the availability of the project. Because what is happening is in TCS, there are already other people who are on bench. There are many other people who are on bench. Still, these people are about to get their project. Now once these people will get the project, then and then only the further process will take place. Because what happens is already there are 100 people are on bench. And if they try to onboard other new people, say for example other 100 people, then it gets 200 people who are supposed to get the projects. So in order to manage these things, the TCS is keeping the people on hold. So that they can allocate you enough project once you enter into the TCS. But the point is, since because of the recession, the project's availability is decreasing. But don't worry, does it mean that you are not going to get the onboarding? No, you are going to get your onboarding, but only a thing is it needs one or two months of time. So you need to keep the wait for one or two more months. Of course, there are some people, there are some people who has got the onboarding on 19th of October or 26th of October. But the point is, these are only the digital profile people. There are still ninja profile people who haven't got any kind of joining. So there is no any need to take any kind of tension that whether I'm going to receive the onboarding or whether I'm going to have the joining letter or not. No, everyone is going to have the joining letter. Only a thing is there might be a delay. So as per of my knowledge, as per of my knowledge, what I can say is what I can say is your joining can go up to up to November or the mid December or I can say that mid December till this everyone everyone is going to get the joining letter so you don't need to have to worry about it because what has happened is all the 2022 batch people all the 2022 batch people has been onboarded right there has been onboarded now only a thing is the 2023 people are remaining so in one or two more months every single person will be onboarded without any reason. Yes, there might be a possibility that once you get onboarded, you can be seated on bench, that you need to sit on the bench because there might be a possibility that once you come in TCS for one or nearly three months, the projects will not be available for us because of the recession in the IT sector. So keeping these things in the mind, we need to prepare ourselves. You have to be mentally strong because there might be a possibility that the delaying causing you anxiety or the tension by sitting in home, but you don't need to worry. So this is all about the situation going on in the TCS because of the number of people are already on bench. So let's check out the upcoming joining dates. So as I told you that for digital profile, they have already mentioned the 19th and 26th of October, right? So these people are going already have received the joining letter for digital profile. So these people will undergo the particular training if they haven't cleared the ILP training. If they have already created, they will directly allocate it to the project according to the availability of the space. Now the big important thing to notice here is the people who are belong to the Ninja profile. So the point is the people who come from Ninja profile, they have to wait. They have to wait. They need to wait till, till what? Till November or mostly or mostly December. So you need to wait till November or December. But I can for sure I can guarantee that till December you will receive your joining letter. For sure you will receive the joining letter. But make sure you prepare for ILP really strong because what will happen once you join TCS you will be having 42 days of training. 
you will be having 42 days of training and if you clear this exam by doing 42 days of training then and then only then and then only you will be allocated to project otherwise you will be kept on bench once again on bench once again and one thing i would like to tell you being in a tcs please avoid being on bench please avoid being on bench because if you are on a bench you might be thinking that i am getting the salary but i don't have work but the point is you will not get the experience so it gets difficult while you are switching the company so you don't need to have to worry digital profile you have already received your joining letter so make sure you keep your documents ready whenever they ask for and ninja profile people so you need to wait till november or the december according to your reason or your college so according to the availability and the business requirement they will call you for joining so this is all about the joining dates now let's look at the process of onboarding the people who have received the joining letter joining letter make sure you keep your documents clear there are many documents like medical certificate is there criminal certificate is there birth certificate is there then pf is there salary account so all these documents should be kept ready so that on your first day on your first day you should submit all the documents even if you try to miss a single document it may delay again it may delay to your joining so don't rush or don't make any casual things in document process because this is the most important thing to any company without documentation process you will not be get onboarded most interesting point that every single document must be the legal don't attach any illegal or in duplicate documents because the further verification takes place so have the clear purpose while attaching the documents and make sure every single thing is real and legal so this was all about the process of onboarding once you join the tcs we will be having the ilp training those for those people who haven't cleared the exam and the people who have cleared the exam you will be having the calls for the project and again you will be giving interviews for the project if you fit well then and then only you will be allocated for that project otherwise again you need to sit on bench only so i hope so you understood this video don't you don't need to worry about when i'm going to receive the joining or not you will receive the joining but there might be a certain delay for nearly november or till december but i can make sure and i can guarantee till mid december everyone is going to have a joining letter especially for the ninja profile because digital profile people have already started receiving the joining letter so ninja profile you don't need to worry those till you have the time learn something learn java believe me if you learn java you will get a good enough project in tcs because in tcs getting technical project it's difficult so if you learn the thing concept like java uh, hibernate spring boot you will get a good project believe me so i hope so this video makes sense for you in order to know more about tcs related updates make sure you subscribe the runtime error till then have a happy coding